everyone welcome to good to know we have another review for you today we have a automatic uh, water faucet from Dun or Mun Madundry Madundry I hope we're pronouncing that right Rebecca's going to come down here and show you what I got here and I'm gonna I've got my other sink taken out it's very simple disconnections only thing that I don't like about this one is it's only what uh, one water source so unless you go by a splitter still you can't control the water heat that way or the coldness so we're just going to attach cold water because that's all we use anyway in there so Rebecca's going to come down here to this all right this is your actual faucet and this is the power cord to it right here so we're going we don't want to plug that in until last so we're going to but we will set we will set this in the sink Rebecca will be showing the top okay part. here's the act we're not going to use the power the power cord you can plug it into the wall or it has uh, four triple double. double a batteries in here so we're going to use we're going to go with the double a batteries you have a water out that would be the one that goes to the faucet and you have a water in from your supply I think these are uh, half inch plugs I'm not sure I didn't read the box it's either a half inch or an inch but the ones coming out of my water source the one that plugs to it is a quarter okay these may be three quarter ends let's see it tells me right here yeah this is a half half inch flip on this side and a three h three eighths on this end so that's what that's what my sink needs every sinks different so before I even get in there I'm gonna go ahead and plug the in to the end so this comes goes to your water supply so we're gonna go ahead and attach that before we even get up under the sink you can use plumbers putty but these things have uh, gaskets inside them so they should hold pretty good so we'll tighten that up we're gonna go ahead and take the out which goes to the faucet and we're gonna go ahead and hook that up so all we have to do is set the faucet in hook up to the faucet hook up to the water and plug the power source in and we're ready to and turn your water on and we're ready to go all right we're gonna go in here and we're going to set the Rebecca's going to show you from the top, but all I'm going to do is it has a washer at the bottom. Let me take this off, show you before we get in there. This gasket goes on the sink itself, on top of the sink. And this little gasket is what holds it in with this nut. And this nut is going to put it in. And I want to point out, this is a, a very nice, shiny faucet. It's uh, going to polish up nice and help hide the... It's going to polish up nice and help hide handprints. And this is your... Um, what is that called? A solenoid? To get the, um, the motion activator. So this is what's going to activate and turn the water pressure or the, turn the water on. Just make sure if you ever do any kind of repairs or tighten or anything like that, you're not doing it uh, in with a flashing light or anything because that will activate it. So let's go see what John is up to I want in to there. Attach the water in. We're not mounting this right yet, but if I need to, two little screws mounts it. One right here and one right here. Very easy mount. Right now there we're just going to get it in and make sure. Up here, we got that. We're going to feed the power source through the hole. And place that. You got a cord stuck in it. There you go. And this takes two people because Rebecca's going to have to hold that here. So she's going to have to put the camera down probably
one room. And we're going to plug in the power supply. And Rebecca's gonna test it. If that's too hard of water, you can turn it down down here. You won't turn down some. Yes. That was easy. That was quick. Yep, no problem. It was no, just get my big body under there. That. You want to make sure nothing's leaking down here. Just this cold. I don't feel no leak. I don't see no leak. And all I have to do is we can come over here and just mount it right here and be out of the way and you can still access for still the access it yep so here's the faucet and all its glory look at that automatically shuts off after two seconds of inactivity or nothing on the sensor A very beautiful piece. I'm loving it. Look how shiny that is. Yep, it's beautiful. All right, that was a very easy setup. Uh, the I used the existing cables with the cable that came with it. Everything worked out fine. We're gonna leave leave a link down into the show board where you can buy this from Amazon. Um, we want to thank y'all for coming and watch this. We're going to get a lot of use out of that. If it's your first time here, please like, subscribe, share, ring that bell so you get our notifications. Go check us out on our um, YouTube cooking channel called Cast Iron Skillet Kitchen and do all the liking, subscribing, and sharing over there also. Most important, y'all come back. Bye. Bye.